This is the PenFriend Utility Dashboard. It has five functions and a PenFriend icon. The functions are Backup Restore Insert MP3 Music Insert a Daisy Book Zip Insert an Audiobook First, connect PenFriend with USB cable and watch out for the change in PenFriend status. Tick means you are connected. Now you are ready to go. Click Backup. The software asks where you want the files backed up. I would suggest that you create a folder called Backup. Open the folder and type in today's date. All the files in PenFriend are immediately copied into the backup folder under today's date. Once done you will see this message backup completed. Suppose for some reason you have lost all your precious recordings. Then connect PenFriend as before and click Restore. This will remove all recordings made after the backup date and restore only the files in the backup folder. Effectively you would have lost any recordings made today. We recommend that you backup just before restore, so that you do not lose any data. Once completed you will see this message. Restore successful. Next, let's look at how to listen to a single audiobook on PenFriend. If you are registered to access the RNIB DAISY library of 35,000 plus audiobooks, donated by publishers, then you can listen free of cost to any book. The DAISY library has zip files. So select the book you want and the software will replace any existing book with the book of choice. Here I have selected, the book of form and emptiness. Rather heavy, but never mind. The software will unzip and automatically install it into the pen. Being very large files, this can take about 5 minutes. Once completed you will see this message. Book transfer complete. PenFriend will remember where you last switched off and automatically take you to the right place next time you continue listening. If you want to install any audiobook, not part of the DAISY library, then first collect all the chapter mp3 files into one folder and click add. The software will go through the same process, it will replace any existing book with the latest audiobook. Last is adding mp3 music. First create a folder on your computer and add your music files. Make sure that you have sorted the playlist with your preferred sequence of music. Then click add. When copying is complete, you will see a message. mp3 copy complete. This PenFriend utility software is broadly one click. For example, to back up next time, just add the date and go. To add a book, once again select the book and go. To add music, identify the music folder and go. This easy software is free and we know that it will be vital for you peace of mind. There are other example videos on this site, but with these help videos you can become very comfortable with PenFriend. This is the end of the PenFriend utility help video. Goodbye.